All right, hello everybody, and welcome to the demo for Bit Escape. Um, <clears throat> it does say controller is recommended, so I'm gonna try that. It's kind of cool. Wasn't sure what to do there. I'm a cute little bit. Look at me. Well, you don't really see a lot of games that um do the whole thing about you being like inside of a computer anymore. Like, I mean, some of the best games I've ever played have you playing as a character that is inside of a computer and then you're, you know, just like the whole experience of trying to escape or do something, you know? And uh and so I, I automatically walk into this with, with pretty hopeful kind of like thoughts. It's a, also a very, very small uh, file size for this demo. Oh, no, no. What were you saying, dude? I was trying to, like, listen to this. Um, this is a lovely day. This city is really cool looking. Uh, cute. No, I'm I totally want to escape. I think it's a checkpoint. Uh, he's probably a bad guy. We're just going to avoid him. Bit doesn't like combat. <clears throat> Whoa, what just happened? How did I not make that? Oh. Oops. Whoops. That was a bad choice. Oh. Cool. That was, like, unexpected. Oh. I will say this is a, a very cool way uh, to, you know, build like a level um, as we're playing. The level is basically unfolding around us, which I don't know that I've seen that a whole lot of times. And that's that's very cool. Uh, this definitely makes it easy to say that this demo is going to stand out uh, as far as like, you know, games I've played. This is definitely be one that kind of stands out. Huh. Well, I'm glad that sent me back here because it seems like uh might have been difficult otherwise to make it back up there. I don't know if like stepping on those dudes would be okay. Uh, I gotta say, I really, really like the design of this level. Like, I mean, as far as, uh, you know, the design of, you know, the way this level has been, uh, just kind of like in general terms. Um... Oh, come on. Yeah, there we go. Uh, but in general terms, when it comes to just like of imp Impressive titles that I have so far so far played for Next Fest. The level design of this one alone easily makes it one of the more impressive titles that I've that I've played. Like I just I I definitely think it's really well designed. Like it looks really nice, really cool. Um I have no idea what the coins are going to be for, uh, but collecting is, is is relatively easy. Whoops, I died. Uh, I died again. Well, at least that death doesn't really matter. Just want this one coin. There we go. Oh, come on. All right, whatever. We, we, we got it. I like that they don't make it so uh, rough on you if you die. 
My platforming skills definitely need some work. <sighs> not, not the fault of the game, I just... Apparently need to, to really focus on my abilities here. Uh, alright. Like an invisible wall? Well, this just keeps getting, like, cooler and cooler with the cool uh, additions, you know? We're adding, like, some Tetris stuff? I mean, come on. How cool is this? I don't... I don't know. Um, my cat is in my face. I, I, I have no abilities here to um, counter counter a cat who's trying to basically get in the way of my ability to do this. Oh, okay, she's gone now. Oh, come on. You know, it, you gotta understand, like, I mean, it's super hard to play games when you got a cat that's, like, trying to, like, you know, cuddle. Oh, man, lowered expectations. In myself. Oh, come on, man. Like, really little... Stupid CDs. Nobody even uses CDs anymore. I don't. Like, I mean, I have a, a USB CD drive because my computer that I bought in 2019 does not have a... Um, oh, come on. It doesn't have a CD drive. No optical drive. I remember back when computers all had, you know, floppy disk drives. I used to have, like, um... Oh, I think they're called, like, zip drives. I don't actually remember, but they were, like, the, you know, like, oh, hey, this this particular storage medium is better than a CD. It's a disc, so it's going to load faster. Uh, and it was, like, the, the, the next big thing. Like, and, and I had one of those, and it was kind of nice. Like, I, I'm not going to say it wasn't bad, so... Neo Grade Z Read Me Dev Studio X. Neo Grade is a vertically scrolling 2D schmip where you blast your way through enemy forces to save Earth from an unknown threat. Well, that sounds awesome. Dude, are we going to go and play as shoot 'em up now? Is that what's going to happen? Like, are we getting like a mini game inside the game? No freaking way. That's exciting. In the year 110. Oh, I swear to God. Like, how, how quickly do you expect people to read? I can't read that fast. To defend humanity against future ether attacks, the NAB organization was established to develop mobile suits known as Neograids. 20 years later, the Aethers have returned. Back. Oh, look at this. Oh, it's like the Death Star. That's badass. Yeah, man. Who, you know, like the, the art director, whoever is in charge of the art design. For this game is like phenomenal like this is easily going to be one of my favorite demos and <laughs> neo crazy has crashed due to an unexpected error oh you have no idea like how like much of um that is just like blue balled me like i was so looking forward to that because it just seemed like it was gonna be badass um, and instead, like, it's just, we're gonna go back into, like, story mode, which is fine, like, I totally get it. It's part of the story, it's cool, but dang, I was really looking forward to playing that shoot 'em up so. Alright, oh, it's, man, it's over, and dang. Alright, well, I, I already have this wish listed, but I pushed the button. Anyway, that's it, that's Bit Escape, hot dang, one of my favorite...
uh, video, uh, game, you know, demos so far for Next Fest. Highly recommended. Go play it. It's great. 